Speak up and judge fairly. Defend the rights of those less fortunate and needy. For whoever oppresses the poor shows contempt. But whoever is kind to the needy honors them. This quote has been at the heart of my practice, where I am the only candidate that has practiced both family and criminal law in a court that hears both family and criminal law cases. I have mainly represented the mentally ill. My practice at its base has been about service. Most recently, I have been humbled and proud to be appointed by the Austin City Council as an associate judge of the Austin Municipal Court, where we see that the majority of the misdemeanors filed in Travis County are for DWI and assault family violence. During my almost two years as an associate judge, I determined that one of the main reasons we had such a large backlog of cases in court four is because there are simply cases on the jury trial docket in court four that should not be there. So I believe in collaboration. It is time for us to create an assault family violence diversion court in court four, where we would divert all cases involving siblings, roommates, parent-child cases, first-time offenders, those cases involving drugs and alcohol as an underlying issue, and those cases involving mental illness as an underlying issue. Successful completion will result in defendants not having a conviction on their record, and we would begin to treat the underlying issue bringing people within the criminal justice system in the first place. I believe in compassion. I am a former board member of the Downtown Austin Community Court. This is the court that mainly serves our homeless residents. I am a current board member of the State Bar Committee Legal Services for the Indigent, where we are improving access to legal services for our citizens in rural communities. I am a former mental health diversion attorney for more than 10 years prior to my appointment, and that work led me to being selected as a Travis County Drug Court Diversion Attorney. I believe in community. If elected, I would be the only African-American judge serving in our misdemeanor courts. This is important because although African-Americans are only 7% of the Travis County population, we are disproportionately represented in the criminal justice system, accounting for more than 33% of all misdemeanors filed in this county, and there are no African-American judges and there has not been for almost 20 years. I am a lifelong Democrat, the child of lifelong Democrats, who marched and fought for the right to vote in the 60s when they were in their 40s. I have been a volunteer deputy registrar for many years, and I routinely work the polls on election day, serving as a judge, alternate judge, election judge, and a clerk. I hope I can count on you for your support and your vote because together we can build a better Travis County criminal justice system. JudgeJeffers.com, Judge Jeffers for Progressive Justice.